to another Maze Plus video and today we're going to have a look at whole crop silage and how much you, you get for the various different options. Um, so we are going to chop it with a forage harvester, we are going to mow it using the green mowing script from Loki and then I'm going to progress it forward and harvest it and we'll see how much we would get from that as well. Um, this is basically a bit of research for me because in my let's plays I need to make whole crop silage so I just wanted to see which was the best, whether um, any of the settings needed tuning to make them feel better, um, and whether whether everything was cool as it was. So, easiest way for me to find out, to actually go through and do it, and find out how much we get for each one. Um, I'm not using silage additive for any of this. You would need to edit the... Um, think anyway you'd need to edit the equipment to get it to work um, because it only works with chaff and we are getting crop swath so yep um, got a tutorial on that so you can go find that on the main channel but it looks like we're getting pretty poor yield off of here my memory with whole crop silage from fs19 and i did it a couple of times um was that the yield was pretty darn awful um yeah, I only did it once, or I think once or twice, once. I remember a soybean field that I had on Oak Hill. It was Oak Hill. Um, Lancey's map it just would not ripen, and so I ended up whole cropping it. Um, that was back when we had real seasons, and, you know, soil temperature affected germination and stuff, and I think the crop was just a bit behind. Um, so I whole cropped it, and, yeah, the yield was not good. And off of here, we've got 13,689 litres with the forage harvester let's try mowing it so part of the latest update to maize plus is green mowing of uh, wheat oats and barley thanks to loki and so let's have a look and see what that gives us i'm skeptical about the yield for this one because it was a fairly late addition to maize plus and so i think it may not be well set up but we'll see um so i've got a a forage wagon on standby to load that as well and then we'll compare it to combining and um, collecting the straw because my my kind of hope is that you get about the same amount of silage as you'd get straw and grain it needs to make sense to me you're chopping the whole plant so you know maybe a bit less in this state but yeah that, that's kind of my thought and my hope and what i'm aiming for if we need to do any tuning of this I'm really focused around the mowing because I really want to have a play with the green mowing in my let's plays. So, all mode. I've missed a couple of bits. I was trying to avoid getting grass basically. Um, so, I could have used course play. That might have done it. A need to job or a worker, but it was a bit of fun. Um, I'm trying to use more of the tractors that I like in the tutorial because I'm really bad at not doing that. Um, I'm really bad at just grabbing what I think is a popular tractor rather than a tractor that I want to use so might see a bit of change there I really like the Deutsch tractors and I'm really bad at making use of them um, and I really like the Fent Black Beauty I used it early on on one of my first Let's Plays it's part of a you know it's paid content or it's free free content for pre-purchase so yeah it doesn't look like we've got that much more you know 17 18,000 litres except that this is the second forage wagon yeah there's another 46 and a half thousand litres sat over there so we got a shed load off of here I'll compare all the numbers properly at the end but we got a lot more than using the forage harvester that says to me that maybe we need to tweak the numbers for the forage harvester later on um, but let's run over it with the combine so I've advanced a day or a month same with how I've got it set up. I'm just going to combine it, see how much we get, see how much straw we get, and uh, we'll then have a look and see what we did yield wise for everything. Um, this has been the same field, I've just been saving and reloading if you're familiar with my tutorials, that's how I do this kind of thing. Um, so the field has always been in the same fertilizing and lime and plowing and all that kind of thing. Um, so the only difference is the equipment or at this point the growth state so we can combine it because you can't combine green you can mow green you can't combine green um, so just getting this last strip off shame i'm going to say a quick thank you to the patrons and the youtube channel members appreciate you all supporting the channel 
your name is whizzing past somewhere on the screen fairly quickly there because the list is getting quite long um, I'm actually thinking I might have to change how I do the perks for it because I'm struggling to fit them all into the game so yeah but we're just going to squeeze the last of this wheat in I've only done wheat in this test because I'm assuming it reads across a similar amount so we've got exactly the same amount of wheat as we got of chaff with the or crop swath with the forage harvester so yeah I think we need I'm not going to do it in this video because I'm really, I was really focused on the green mowing, if I'm honest. But I think we might need to adjust the yield with the forage harvester. Um, you could use a direct disc, and I think that would behave as a mower. So you'd get the same amount then as mowing it, I think. Um, so let's get this straw collected and see how much we get. And how that compares to what we got from the, direct, from the mowing. Because... Yeah, the mowing is looking pretty darn good and particularly with how much animals eat in maize plus green mowing your grains might actually be a good way of getting some more feed in for them um, so last row and again we got more than a loading wagon full of straw off of here so pretty good yield with the combine and the straw good yield with the mowing not so good with the forage harvester so yep can uh, let me know your thoughts on that in the comments as to things that might need tweaking um, let's have a look at the numbers so yeah forage harvester 13 6 8 9 same as we got from the wheat just by combining it and then 56,000 litres of straw versus 65,500 litres with the mower so a little bit less than combining it but I think a pretty good yield given that you can get it a month early as well so yeah Hopefully you found this video useful. If you did, please click the like button. Comments, questions, suggestions, use the section below. Um, happy to discuss this kind of thing. Uh, if you're new to the channel and you've watched this uh, and you want to see more of this kind of thing, subscribe, turn on notifications. There are lots of Maze Plus related videos on the channel. There is in fact a playlist and I'll try and remember to link that in the top right hand corner now. Um, also if you want to talk all things Maze Plus there is the Maze Plus Discord and that will be linked below and if you want to chat to me there's a link for my Discord and if you want to support the channel like the others there's links for Patreon and YouTube channel membership I will see you next time